Uh, cancer tears families apart simply because of the tension and the fear. And even though you get a lot of support from your family, uh, after a while, that support also frays. We wanted to build a program that meets people where they are. We didn't want to build something that required people to jump through hoops or uh, fill out paperwork or, or do specific things. We wanted to be flexible, we wanted to be supportive, and we wanted to fit into people's lives, not need them to fit into our organization. Throughout chemotherapy and my surgical recovery, it was great for my husband to have a place to go, to take a deep breath, exercise, and kind of focus on himself. Walking into the Y was a marvelous experience for me. People were welcoming, they were understanding, they were encouraging. Uh, I think the best thing that I got out of my work at the Y was a sense that people uh, appreciated the small victories that you have to have as you meet your goals for recovery. I live in senior housing and there are a number of people there with cancer. So it's a mission of mine to convince them to join this program because it brings back health and you don't feel alone. There is a tangible result for those people fighting, for those families affected. They have less anxiety, they have less stress. They have more help, they have more assistance, and that will better their fight, that'll strengthen them, that'll take more off their plate. So I would consider that a very real and tangible result to the generosity of our donors who would support this program. So I got stronger, um, and I enjoyed it so much. Now I'm working for the Y and I work with children. I work in the kids club and every day I'm thankful that I'm alive and I can pay it forward.